Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Charlene, for those of you who are new. And to my loyal subscribers, thank you as always for coming back. Today I'm bringing you this limited edition Cinnabar Indulgent Duo from Estee Lauder. I love Estee Lauder's packaging. They always outdo themselves. It is perfect for the holidays. Like you can reuse this box. It is so pretty. When I saw this set online, I was immediately intrigued. I wanted to know what it was. I purchased this set the same time I bought the Blockbuster set. So you open it up and this is the set right here. When I saw it, I was very intrigued because I hadn't seen it before and I was like, I definitely want to smell this one. The Cinnabar was the one that called out to me immediately. The scent profile, the notes, all of it called out to me. I was like, okay, this is the one I'm going to get. The packaging looks like this. It is a 1.7 fluid ounce and I like the packaging. It's so simple, but at the same time, it kind of called out to me, like I said, it's an acquired taste. So I'm definitely not here telling you to go grab the Cinnabar Duo. I'm gonna spray it on my hand. I love the sprayer, by the way, look at that. The sprayer is everything. If you look closely, you will see like the details on the top. There's a lot of texture here, which I'm liking. Also here as well, so I like the feel to it. This has notes of jasmine, orange flower, clove, and patchouli. This is described as an intriguing, intense, sensual experience. Um, I'm very open to most fragrances, but I definitely had to take some time on this one. Cinnabar, I love the name. I do get a very spicy feel to this one. I think the clove and patchouli blend makes it spicy in a lot of ways. So, so different, but man, it is an acquired taste. So the notes in this, I really like. The finish on my skin, the clove in this is intensified for sure. Overall, not a bad blend, just an acquired taste, as I've mentioned a hundred times. It almost gives me a very classic feel to the fragrance. Not one that I smell on an everyday basis. So I would say it's very unique in a lot of ways. I've tried it before and I feel like the longevity is pretty good. Projection is amazing and the sprayer, as you saw, is definitely amazing, but it is something different. <laughs> the Luxe Body Cream is very nice. It is not the same fragrance. It's very, very silky smooth. There's a very mild scent to it as well. So it doesn't smell like Cinnabar, they just come together for whatever reason. This duo has a $92 value. You only get it for $65, not a bad deal. When giving the directions on how to use it, they basically tell you to start with the scented body lotion and the matching perfume on top. I do not feel like it matches Cinnabar to an exact science. It is scented, but not too much. This is described as exotic, mysterious, and warm. I agree in a lot of ways that it is exotic mysterious and warm. There's almost like an intense cinnamon touch to it. There's no cinnamon listed. It is the clove in there, but it gives that vibe. So if you like cinnamon, you might like this. I don't hate it. I'm just not in love. I'm in love with the name of the fragrance more than I am with the actual fragrance. It has its unique qualities that I appreciate for sure. That is it for the video. Let me know what you guys think about this indulgent duo. Is it something you're curious about? Do you want to sniff it? Do you want to smell it? What do you think about this? And do you like the notes I mentioned here? So would I recommend it? Because it is an acquired taste, I would say give it a sniff on your own. I do not know what you guys like and you might very much love this. But for me, it's just an okay fragrance that I don't see myself wearing very often. I could see myself pulling this out in the winter, but for now, it's just not something I'll be reaching for a lot. I'm gonna keep it because it is unique and I can find other fragrances and lotions I could layer this with to make it really nice. Plus it's a limited edition fragrance, so why not? That is it for me. Thank you as always for stopping by. I'll be seeing you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.